bass car paint with the airbrush. Why I'm doing that test on a car, not that one, that one is cool. <laughs> What's going on guys and today I'm gonna try to spray the oil based car paint with the airbrush. Uh, I've been trying to look for that type of videos uh, in the internet. No matter what's gonna happen, if I'm gonna be able to spray it, uh, the paint through the airbrush or if I'm not gonna be able, I will post the video. Uh, in today's tryout I'm gonna be using the acetone to thin the paint. In a perfect case scenario you got to use the paint thinner uh, the oil based one but uh, we'll see what's gonna happen with uh, with that kind of trick as well as the paint in the cans uh, already thin enough to go through the actual nozzle here which is really beat up but anyway uh, it should work as far as I understand it should work so uh, we'll see, it's just a regular black paint. I got that one from the Amazon, I've been fixing some uh, spots in my car. Anvil compressor, which is the 100 PSI. I set it to the 25, uh, 25 PSI or a uh, little less than two bars. We have really cheap airbrush from the Amazon for about 25 bucks. I've been spraying the acrylic paint and it's working pretty good. The actual needle is 0.5 mil which is the biggest one. Why I'm doing that test, in the future I wanna do like small spots like on a car, not that one. That one is well, will be fixed if somebody interested about the uh, body work, I'm gonna be doing it by myself, gonna try to straighten it up and uh, gonna repaint it by the, with the original color. Also, I'm gonna try to airbrush at some of the spots like that. At least I will try to spray it on and send it down with uh, like covering that gap. Because of the airbrush is uh, spraying really thin a layer, that can goes uh, pretty well. So we'll see in a different episode, but in that episode we'll try to fix everything. I have my, uh, I have my cup. I just gonna spray some paint in there. I will, uh, and as you can see it's working just fine so we are empty in there and Right now we're gonna try to clean it up the actual airbrush because it's totally messed it up. We're just gonna put some acetone in there. So for the tiny spots like that, it should be pretty good. I would say four mil or three mil needle gonna work just fine uh, because uh, the 0.5 mil needle Sorry for the voice. Because of the 0.5 uh, mil needle is, uh, I would say it's pretty big. Uh, it's spraying paint, it's spraying paint a uh, little bit over it. So you can see it's pretty clean inside. I will do a couple more. We'll clean the needle after all. See the actual needle. So I think the actual, uh, the actual task was successful. I mean, yes, it was uh, the spray can uh, paint, but you definitely can thin the paint with the acetone, I mean, paint thinner, and uh, work it out. The actual, uh, the actual spray is pretty good. So, as you can see, it's pretty consistent lines in there. Some of the spots are a little overbit, but anyway, we got great results. Uh, now we know we definitely can uh, spray the uh, regular oil-based paint through the airbrush. So I would say the mission is complete and everything is successful. If you guys like the video, please put the thumbs up button in there, subscribe to my channel, and we will test it out the actual uh, uh, airbrush on a car, and we'll see what's gonna happen. I'll see you next one.